G'day Carbonites, welcome back to Ark Brutal Evolved here on the Ragnarok server. Today I thought we could possibly go out and uh, tame some creatures. Uh, first we have some stuff to go through. So off camera, I built up uh, this wall to protect our dinos. Um, I had a, a comment on uh, Twitter actually saying that we should, you know, we should get the wall up <laughs> because of uh, the giga threat. And uh, yeah, so I, I did that. I put a nice little staircase over this side so we can get up to the top. I really like how this turned out. It, um, like I was, I was struggling to find a good place for the, the gate. Um, and I sort of jammed it in this corner here, but it, yeah, it turned out really cool. And we got to a, we got to a spot where I was, uh, placing the railings and I noticed that I was getting a bit of lag. You know, when you, you have a really large uh, build that you're doing and every time you try to place uh, a piece, the, the game lags down to like five frames. I started to get that when I was placing the railings. So I, I went around and tried to optimize the base a little bit. And uh, what I ended up doing is replacing a lot of these single walls with uh, the large walls, which are, are four, four walls in one. Yeah, so it looks like I started here. So basically all the inside, oh, actually the outside is done on, on this wall as well, but not on the other wall. On the other wall, I've only done the inside um, because the outside I'm going to do like turrets and, um, and stuff like that. So I'm going to need the single walls. Um, oh, another thing I was thinking of is the pillars. We've used uh, single pillars. So I can optimize the base a little bit by replacing... Uh, these like large sections with uh, just a couple of large pillars instead. So I'll drop it down from five pieces down to one. Um, so I've been doing that to try and optimize the base a bit. It still takes a while to load in. Uh, it's probably a good 15 to 20 seconds to load in the entire base. Which, um, yeah, I, I really don't like that. Um, let's get rid of the name tags. On, on stream, we did the uh, the wood centerpiece in the uh, in the four locations. That was really cool. A good addition, I think. And uh, then we worked on the staircase. So I had a comment um, stating that we should continue on with the, the grand uh, staircase that we've got right in the center, rather than trying to do one stair smaller staircase at either end, uh, because that'll ruin the, the windows we've got at the end. So I'm going to pull that one down over there, and what I'll do is I'll put all our little, um, our little shoulder mounts and stuff like that in, I don't know, some sort of a cage down there or something like that. Because there's a, there'll be a fair bit of space over there. And so, yeah, we, we did this on stream. I did have to pull down uh, quite a bit of the build. And I probably don't need to come out this far. Because I only need really two tiles to get dinos up there. Well, most dinos anyway. All the large ones are going to be down the bottom. So I could probably, yeah, just trim this back in line with uh, the bottom structure. And then... Um, I'll figure out a way to continue these uh, these pillars that we've got because I really wanted the four of them in the, in the center piece here. And I probably don't need to come up this high either. So I'm probably going to drop all of this down by one wall. And they'll give us a bit more room up the top here. So yeah, it's coming along. This is uh, just an area where I think we're going to be storing our Brontos and Gigas, maybe. It's probably not big enough for it, but we'll see how it goes. Um, what else did I do? Oh, I tamed up a few more creatures. Nothing nothing exciting, just 
I just I just found some creatures. Um, we've got a couple of uh, Ankies. Sadly, they're all males. So I've got four four male Ankies now. Um. Oh no, I killed one. Uh, because the the stats were absolutely useless. So yeah, I've I've kept those ones, and we do have a female turtle now. Um. Oh, I did a trade with uh, Vithri. The the guys on the stream have already seen this. Um, so th these are beauties that he'd been uh, breeding up. So we've got a mating, uh, a mating pair, and uh, the stats are really, really good on them. Um, he's in the eighties on uh, damage and health, uh, and, and the rest of them are, are just pretty average. But yeah, really, really good dinos. So I traded him a couple of our Gen Four Raptors for uh, for two of those. So I think, yeah, I think that was a good deal. Um, I don't think there's anything else. Look at that red squadron. That look awesome. Um... Oh, that's right. I uh, I did this as well. So I felt like the the two preserving bins was uh, was going to be enough. These are finally finished. Um, yeah. So I ripped out that one and I put a beer barrel in here. So I thought that'd be that'd be pretty good. And yeah, I managed to get it to where it's not clipping through this wall because this is a triangle piece here, and the the beer barrel is quite large, so I did have to pull it forward uh, quite a bit. So it is sticking out the front, but I'd rather that than it poking out of this wall here. I've been uh, cooking up some lamb. So yeah, we've got a shitload. I'm going to start using this as, um, we can use it as healing food for dinos and we can also use it for, uh, to feed all the, um, all the carnivores. Because we've got so much of it and there's sheep everywhere around our base. Like it just, it makes too much sense to, to be using it. Alright, so we're, we're pretty good on, um, jerky now. I don't think we need to worry about that for a little while. And uh, kibble's looking pretty good. Um, I've been stockpiling a shitload of um, Sarko eggs because we can use them to tame uh, Titan of Boas. And I want to get um, Titan of Boa kibble uh, for Thylers. Uh, I guess uh, Gigantopithecus as well. But mainly for Thylers because we're, we're losing, um, losing too many levels. If we try to tame them with anything else. Which is... Um, I feel how it should be. I feel like you shouldn't be able to get perfect tames off um, just meat. And I think that's what I'll be um, doing with the mod. When we create a uh, brutal arc. I picked up a red drop before I started recording and it had uh, a better Megatherium saddle in it, 98 armor as opposed to 94. Um, but look at the, the cost difference. This one costs 18,000 cementing paste and this one's only 2,400 so that's useless in my opinion. I'd rather just take the, the four less armor. 18,000 cementy base, fuck that. 60,000 hide. Yeah, so I I left it here just so I could show you, but yeah, we're going to drop that. Um, got Yeah, we've got a couple of saddles. Um, Stego saddle that we can use, uh, Pteranodon saddle. There was one more. No, um...
Maybe not. Might have just been those two. Yeah, anyway. Alright, so I'm going to have to repair my stuff. I noticed my um, hatchet and long neck are getting pretty ruined. How's our armor doing? Armor's fine. Alright, so that looks good. Um, we've got enough ammo, um, looks pretty good. Now, what are we going out to tame? I wouldn't mind getting uh, a female Kano, so we can start getting Kano eggs, I think that'd be pretty good. And, um, we might have a go at taming a Titan of Boa. Now, I've never tamed one before, so... It will most likely be a gigantic failure, but um, failures are, are, you know, generally uh, fun to watch. So we'll, um, we'll we'll definitely give it a go. Um, where would the uh, the best place for a Kano be? There's Kano's in the desert, isn't there? I've got the raft um, sort of down in that region. Yeah, because the uh, the raft is so fucking slow, and we're going back and forth, like, it's it's 40 minutes to, to get there and back. Um, so I've just left the raft down there and put a telepa teleporter pad on there. Just It's just chewing up way too much time. So, yeah. Um, I don't think there's Kano's in this sort of region, but we could go down here. I'm pretty sure... Pretty sure we should find some around there somewhere. We've actually um, explored quite a lot of the map now. I hadn't realized. Doing good. Should probably take some more of this kibble as well. Oh, I did a trade with uh, Myth. He uh, he took a hundred... Um, wrapped a egg kibble and uh, and I got uh, terror bird egg kibble because uh, that will be uh, useful for the rhinos that we're going to be taming and breeding. We should do that today actually. Let's try and get some rhinos. Start breeding them up. Alright and I'm going to try and take as many of those as I can and we'll just teleport to the raft. Awesome. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Um, I did some modifications to the raft. Uh, I was basically, I was sick of losing shit. Um, we, we lost the preserving bin. Because the, um, the railings uh, don't provide any, any protection, basically even if you turn them into half walls. So we've got glass now, and um, it, it makes it a lot easier to be able to spot dinos and, and stuff like that. So yeah, we've got some glass down here. Also had um, glass doors put in here so we can actually see where the tame is. So, you know, if we're, uh, if we need to go through this door, we can see where it is. And, um, and I've put the glass doors in the, um, and the uh, dino gates as well. So we did that up the top as well. And I just jumped off the ladder like an idiot. Yeah, so we've got some nice big windows here. Really good view. Basically see everything. And then, yeah, same with the uh, these doors here. So yeah, I like it. It's um, It's coming along. Alright, let's go for the um, Kano first, because I feel like that's, that's going to be fairly easy. Uh, the only challenge is going to be finding it. So yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cut this out, and um, I'll bring you guys back when we actually uh, find one. 
Actually, while we're here... Let's see if we have any... Lymantrias. There's a few pigs there. Check what level they are. 600, 550, 300 female with 7,200 health. Yep. Yeah. Uh, we're, we're not breeding them, but um, like someone's going to. We've got plenty of kibble. May as well fucking tame them up. All right, let's do it. I think it just went behind the, uh... Yep. Did it just get distracted? Ah, oh, you fucking idiots. <laughs> oh, there's a male there as well. What level is that guy? 600. Oi, you dickheads. Oh, well, we've got one in. That Morella Tops is trying to get in. Like a dickhead. Where's the other one? There he is. Hmm. All right, this is this is going to be risky. Oh, what? Oh, <laughs> lag nearly killed me. All right, we got both of them. Let's get offshore. Finally, fuck. All right, we're going to do headshots. Fuck this. Um... See if we can get in here. No, that's not it. No. Maybe it's in the bottom jaw? Yeah, there it is. Got some pre-made here for this situation. Fucking go to sleep. Alright, pig's finally down. You're absolutely fucking starving. Alright, that's that's good, I guess. Um, okay. So we've got the kibble for these guys. Uh, well, we've got some kibble. I don't know if it's going to be enough, to be honest. Because these guys eat a fucking shitload. Um, Alright, let's grab that. And we'll grab some... Just some regular meat. Uh, just so they don't eat all my kibble. 
when they when they tame up. All right, so we want to put that on there and put that on there. Actually, give me give me half of that. Oh, so much better. Oh, I need some of that meat. It's doing 10% each time. That's really, really good. Beautiful. Alright, first uh, perfect tame. First perfect tame pig. And uh, we'll put this away. So it only used 20. Really, really good. I, I was, um, I was worried it was going to use like 50 to 60 <laughs> per tame. Just because of how much meat they fucking go through. But yeah, no, this was, uh, this was good. Alright, let's grab those saddles. Uh, typical Timmy Carbine video. We go out saying we're going to grab, uh, a Kano. We'll grab a pig instead. A couple of pigs. Um, let's... Let's go to the shore to do this. I don't like taking them in the water because sometimes they can't get up the ramp. And then they're just, um... Easy pickings, basically. I really like this uh, taming pen. It's, I think we've got a really good design here. Like, there's a, there's a couple of things I would I would fix on it, um, make it a little bit more efficient. But overall, this is yeah, it's really really good for, for multi taming. All right, let's go. So yeah, I did want to see if we, there was a couple of limantrias that we could tame. Because we've got the thorny egg, thorny egg, um, kibble. Thorny dragon egg kibble. Uh, actually, while we're, while we're going around here. Um, have we got any gunpowder? No. Do we have the means of making it? What do we need? Charcoal and spark powder? It's probably spark powder. Let's, um, let's make that. Yeah, so I want to make some, um, some more appetizer darts. So we've got a couple of stacks of appetizer X there. But I've got to make the uh, rifle bullets. 600. Yeah, so we're, we're still on the prowl for raptors. Because uh, we, we need that higher health and, and higher um, food stat. Alright, so raptor off to the left. There's an 850 and there's a Lymantria over here. Which is a 250 female. Fucking perfect. What else have we got around there? Nothing that's going to be dangerous. All right, let's get over there. I don't know how difficult they are to knock out. I don't think they were very difficult. I think they were fairly easy. It's just um, simple bowler and and trank method, right? Yep, right in the right in the raft. No, okay. No, I don't want to knock you out in the water. All right, we're going over here. Here we go. Shit. 
fucking bugs. I don't have time for you, you little fucks. That guy's not going to get knocked out, is he? Fucking bastard. What do you get up to? Uh, 3,000 out of 8,000? Why the fuck does that guy have 8,000 torpor? Oh, different method for that. Maybe use the, um... Use the time that we have when we've, uh bowled it to build a trap around it. Maybe that'd be a better strategy. Yeah, because we only got up to 3,800 torpor out of 8,000, so it'd take two more bowlers to actually get it. Alright, that's a shame, but lesson learnt. Donkey saddle. Something we can use anyway. It's not it's not over limit, so it's good. Do you want to come for a ride? Uh, I don't I don't really wanna Nah fuck it. I'm not I'm not taming the Procoptodon. Is that that same Lymantria? If it is, it is, okay. Let's fucking, let's trap it. Let's, um... Alright. Um... Fucking place. I, oh shit. All right, I think we got it. Beautiful. Alright. Just gotta grab some thorny egg kibble. Thorny dragon egg kibble. And put these building supplies away. See if we can make a Lymantria saddle. Actually, it might be honest. Yep, it is. Stop pushing me around, dickhead. Alright, ease up. Ease up, big fella. You're in the foundation. Beautiful. There's a demo gun. Okay, that was successful, in my opinion. Give me these back, and you don't need that. Alright. Oh, fuck that. We're flying it. I don't care. 
Nice, just glitch through the door. That's what I like to see. Beautiful. That was, uh, that's our first flyer. Awesome. All right, Taming Expedition is going well, I think. Let's put this stuff back. And we've got a saddle there to take back. Um, how's that spark powder doing? Yeah, all right, we'll just leave it in there. Um, see if we can make some gunpowder. Beautiful. Okay, let's head over to the, the proper desert and uh, see if we can get ourselves a Kano.